All right, in this video, we're going to take a look at moving a DXF drawing that's not drawn at zero zero. It's out here in space, or you might just need to move the zero zero just to another place on the the part itself. So we'll open up our test DXF, and use your scroll wheel to zoom in or zoom out. And you can see how far we are from the uh, zero zero crosshairs. So we'll we'll move this part from the center of this circle to here. Start by selecting our circle, insert a point, centers. Okay. And we'll select this point, come down here to where, where it says collection. And here you can see the position. Those numbers are from zero, 00 here up to that point right here. So kind of an easy way to do it is I just copy here. Go to the pad, paste my X, and grab the Y again, copy. Paste. Cancel out. Now we select the whole drawing. Go down here to where it says transform. Click right here. Open this window. And this is your X position. And this is your Y position. So we'll start by grabbing our X. Paste. And since we will move in the opposite direction, what it says here, so we'll just remove the minus, grab our Y, and again we want to move the opposite direction. Click OK. Now, while holding Hold down your Alt key and double click on the screen. It brings your print to center. Now, while everything is selected, you need to right click, apply transformations. OK. What that does is, it before we've done that, it still thinks the print's way up there where it was out in space. So, when you do that, it applies the new coordinates to everything. Alright. So let's do another one, except this time we'll go to a corner of this line. So we'll select this line, insert, point list, divide geometry. Let's just do it three times. And it puts a point at the ends and one in the middle. Select this, and you can see it automatically selects all three. When you come down here in the properties block, it'll show all three of them. And let's move it to this point here, which is the first one. Copy. Pretty much just the same things we did before. Another thing you can do besides dragging the window to select everything is just hold down your control key and your A button and select everything. Go back down here to our properties block, open it, go back to our notepad, grab our X position. Paste. We'll move the opposite direction. Grab our Y. We'll move 
far corner. Require transformations. And same thing as if you wanted to move to the center of this dot, you put the numbers in for it or to this left hand corner. And that should pretty much give you a good idea of how to move your front around to wherever you want it, wherever you want to place your zero at. That's just about any any drawing you got. And that's it.